Alright guys, welcome to episode 26 of my horror movie reviews. Today I'm going to be reviewing Cold Prey. This is a Norwegian film from 2006, directed by Raoul Uthaug, produced by Martin Lund Lund Sundland and Magna Lindgren Lindgner, sorry if I can't pronounce these very well, um, written by Thomas Molderstad and Raoul Uthaug. Um, the cast Ingrid Bolso Birdal as Yannicka, um, Thomas Alf Larson as Eric, Victoria Vinga as Ingen, Andre Martin Mitzkitstigen as Mikkel, and Runa Melbe as Olaf Brath. Um, and the film starts off, there's a group of young adults. Um, three guys and two girls and they travel up um, into the Norwegian mountains to go snowboarding and they travel a long way out um, into the wilderness thick in snow and then they, they park the car up and they climb a big mountain and they're all having fun shooting down on these snowboards and then one of them breaks his leg and they've already climbed over the mountain and gone down the other side so the car's miles back that way and um, he's broken his leg like, pretty bad his um, bone has pierced the skin so it's an airline fracture and um, they can't carry him back up the mountain so they have to go another way so they're trekking through and they're carrying him um, I think he's laid on the snowboard and they're pulling him and they come across an old abandoned hotel in the middle of nowhere so they go up to the hotel and they break in and it seems pretty nice and this they're like gonna hole up there till um, the snow stops a little bit and one of them then can get out and go and look for help so they stay there and they get comfortable they light the fire and find some music and stuff like that they all get comfortable and then one of the couples, because the the um, two girls are with two of the boys, one of the couples decide to go off um, on an adventure, walking around exploring the hotel. And um, they come, they they think, oh, we'll go in a room and have sex. And they go in one of the rooms, and there's a nice little reference to um, the Shining because they go in room two three seven and everybody will know that that's the um, fucked up room in the Shining's hotel and that's in the snow and in the big hotel so I think that was a little reference to the Shining and after they've done whatever they're doing um, they have a little argument and the guy goes off and leaves the girl so she has a shower but I don't know where they've got hot water from if it's abandoned because I, I just no idea but she has a shower, it don't bother me. And then she comes out and she realises that there's something there. She doesn't feel safe. She has a little look round and she thinks it's her boyfriend, but it ain't. And then this big fucking killer, this slasher guy comes. You don't really see much of him at the start and he starts hacking her to bits. And she runs through the hotel um, and as he's, as he's getting her, and she gets up to the steps to where they are because there's some steps up and then there's like a lobby where they're all chilling out and she's just about, about to get up to the steps and the killer gets her and then he starts going round picking them all off one by one and this killer he looks he looks fucking awesome honestly he's like he's bigger than Jason do you know he's, he's a lot more built than Jason and he's a very scary character and I'm, I think it were it were great that they come up with with that sort of character. Um, yeah, it's it's one of my favourite slashers since the eighties. This I think they did a great job. There's um, a sequel out to it and another sequel coming out soon. Um, I will be reviewing the sequel very soon, and then when part three comes out, I'll definitely be getting that. So I'm a big fan of these called Prey movies, um, and I'm a big fan of Norwegian horror. Um, in general, I think they're coming up in the horror world very quietly. No, you never hear people mention much about Norwegian horror. You hear them talk about Dead Snow sometimes, but you never hear people talk about these films. 
and if you give them a watch they're really well done and I think Norwegian, Norway is creeping up the horror ladder um, with the countries um, very quietly no one seems to notice them um, and they're bringing some pretty good horror films out at the minute um, that's all because semi it's I really 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 recommend this um, if you're in slasher films they did an awesome job with it um, the killer looks great there's some suspenseful moments um, and if you just like people get if you just like seeing people get fucked up by an unstoppable killer then you're gonna love this film um, so yeah I would definitely recommend Cold Prey go out and see it as soon as you can it's um, Norwegian with English subtitles but you'll find out once you've got into the film you'll realize that you're not reading it because it's a very well made film so thanks guys and look out for me in episode 27